Why do leaves change color in the fall? Where do these colors come from? We're going to do an experiment that reveals the hidden colors that are in these leaves year round. Here's what you need to get started. A spoon or something to stir and mash the leaves with, scissors, paper towels or coffee filters cut into strips, rubbing alcohol or nail polish remover, a glass jar for each color leaf you're examining, and assorted color leaves. Separate each leaf by their color. Next, you'll want to rip each leaf into tiny pieces. The smaller the pieces, the better the color will show up. The more leaves you have per color, the better. This will make your results stronger. Once your leaf pieces are all set, Lay down a towel or a thick piece of paper to protect the surface that you're working on. Organize the leaves by their color and place each color in their own glass jar. With an adult's help, slowly pour in the rubbing alcohol or nail polish remover into each one of your glass jars. Be careful because this stuff isn't always safe to touch. Using your spoon, Mash the leaves into the liquid. The more that you mash them, the better the colors will come out. Take your cut paper towel strips and measure them so that they fit in the glass. You want the bottom of the paper towel to be touching the liquid mixture. And now it's time for the most difficult part of the experiment, waiting. Let your glasses sit for at least 24 hours. What do you predict will happen? In your experiment, you will notice a variety of colors in each testing strip. The chlorophyll has broken down and revealed the hidden colors underneath. Chlorophyll gives leaves their green color. Carotene gives leaves their orange color. Xanthophyll gives leaves their yellow color and anthocyanin gives leaves their red color. In each strip, there is yellow and some orange. These are the colors that are present year round. Notice that although this leaf was red, there is still chlorophyll, xanthophyll, and carotene present. These are the pigments that are always inside leaves. Anthocyanin is the red pigment in leaves. This pigment can only be produced by certain trees under certain conditions. In the brown leaf, the chlorophyll has gone, but there is still xanthophyll and carotene present. The yellow and orange leaves are very similar. This is because their pigmentation is very similar. Chlorophyll, carotene, Xanthophyll and anthocyanin are present in other plants and fruits and vegetables. Try this experiment at home with leaves that you find in your neighborhood. Or look in the refrigerator. What kind of fruit and vegetables do you have that show these colors? Are the colors in your leaves the same as in your strawberries? What about in your spinach? Let us know what you find and have lots of fun.